welcome back to Making Everyday Magic. My name is Shauna. If you are new here, we are a homeschooling family of four who loves to encourage you to, I don't know, succeed on your homeschooling journey, hopefully, to embrace secular curriculum choices and to really just enjoy the homeschool lifestyle. We come here and we share what we are using along the way to, uh, to hopefully help I don't know, open some doors, provide more resources because it's been such a struggle um, in our own journey to find secular curriculum and just to find people who I felt homeschooled the way that we did. So we come here and we share. And today I want to take you along for our very first day using the Math You See curriculum level Zeta. Guys, before we go any further, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. As always, you can find us right on down in the comments or over on Instagram at Making Everyday Magic. Now, uh, you guys know I've talked about this so many times. We use Timberdoodle for kind of like the bulk base of our curriculum every year. I can customize the kits. They're super awesome. They're super amazing. And in switching from what we started out using, which was the uh, Texas Tech ISD program, switching to Timberdoodle non-religious curriculum kits, we were introduced to the Matthew C program. We absolutely love, love, love the Matthew C program um, from the Demi Learning Company. It is just, I don't know how or why, it is just a curriculum that seems to resonate so well with my kids. And I don't know if that's just because I feel like it resonates really well with me. So maybe it's just like my vibe going on to them. Uh, we are now, we have used officially today, since it was our first day using Zeta, we've officially used every level to Zeta. So uh, I, I mean, that's, I think that's like over half. So we might be experts over here. But today was our first day using Zeta. If you guys have been following along um, this year, I guess really our whole homeschool kind of journey here. My little one uh, zipped through really quickly Matthew C primer. And so she is one level ahead of where the kits would place her. Um, so she's in beta, which this year is multiple digit addition and subtraction. And my older daughter, who's like, who's in fifth grade, uh, she zipped through for whatever reason this year in our 2022, 2023 school year, her fifth grade year, she zipped through fractions. So by zipping through fractions, we are now starting because Matthew C takes a mastery approach and not a spiral approach. So she did like all of fractions. So now we will be doing all of decimals and percentages. So that's what Zeta level is. And so uh, there's another new kind of like fun thing. If you're unfamiliar with the Matthew C program and the way that it works, it's like it's multi-sensory approach. So they have a uh, worksheet. So they've got like level A through G worksheets. Uh, the first few are lesson specific. The next ones are systematic review, which covers everything from like the last unit up to that point. And then there's application and enrichment, like how would you use this in the real world? Uh, there are lesson tests, which we don't use. And then there are unit tests, which is every so many lessons you do like a unit exam. There are special integers, which I think is really what makes all the difference when they're learning early that goes specifically with this program. The block is the exact same block as on the page. Like it's the same block you watch Mr. Demi use when he's giving the math lessons, which is part of what I absolutely love as like somebody who, um, you know, is, uh, is trying to reframe her math approach, her personal math feelings, let's call it that, uh, is the video lessons with Mr. Demi. So there's the video lessons where somebody else does it and um, I am support staff. And so there's like a teacher's manual and the DVD. And then there's also the kit that we get comes with the code where we can use even more resources online. It's so comprehensive. It's so awesome and amazing. We absolutely love it. Again, we've used it for so long now, so long. We've used so many levels. So I love the approach. If you're looking for something that's simple, there's no color, there's no drawings, there's it's just 
boom, math. And because of that, and you really can use as much or as little as you need to and or want to. And so because of that, I do feel like it has been really awesome for our homeschool. So I just want to take you along. I'm going to show you a little unboxing. I'm going to show you our very first lesson in Zeta because we did that today over exponents. So all right, guys, I normally don't do a voiceover for our unboxings, but my kids are being super wild upstairs. So there's just no way that I could have narrated this and like actually had you hear it. So my package of Zeta came kind of all on its own because it was a mid-year purchase here. And as you can see, everything was packaged nicely. It's like all shrink wrapped and it has all the pieces that we need, which is the DVD, the code to do all of the extras online, the student workbook, the test workbook, the instructor workbook, and the special algebra decimal insert kit, which is used in conjunction with the blocks that you get in any other level. So it's just an additional thing that kind of like they kind of like click on and help you to understand the smaller numbers. So it helps you kind of illustrate and and tangibly be able to touch the um the decimal portions. Now this lets me know that this is actually packaged. Matthew C has their integers packaged by people with special needs and they just want you to know that. And I think that is wonderful and glorious that they are helping to employ a whole range of people at their companies. And I think it's fantastic. So I appreciate that they did let me know. As you can see, those little things kind of click on uh, like plates over a Lego for lack of under, like for lack of explaining. Oh, there you go. See, so you can, went ahead and showed you that. I think that's fantastic. Now here you can see all of the pieces. Um, the instructor manual really does just go over kind of what he does in the videos, but it also has the complete answer solutions to every single sheet, every single unit test, every single chapter test. And then there's like a glossary and extra resources. Very handy, very, very handy. So we love the teacher's manual for sure. So we have that, and I'm just giving you a little flip through here. As you can see, it's all just plain and black and white, which I think is great. I don't need it. My kids don't need a lot of fluff or entertainment with math. We want to get in, get it done, get out. There's the DVD instruction, which is the best thing that has ever happened to math in our homeschool because it is not me doing it. It is the man on the TV, and I am just the support staff, and that works for us. As you can see, here's the student workbook, and it's just plain, plain and simple. Not a million problems. Get in, get done. It's less than 20. I think consistently. Um, and then here's the test booklet of which we usually only do the unit exams because we just don't do everything. You know, there's so many sheets. We don't do every single one. Here's a video instruction. Um, we do, you know, there's like A through F sheets and we do every other one unless we need more practice. So that's how it works for us. So they did number one for you. Do you see what, how it is? Yeah. It's three across three down. So it's three squared. And do you remember what that means? That means squared means that you go three times three. Perfect. Or anything times itself. Right. Okay. So this is the same way. So this is yeah. 11. Mm -hmm. one, okay. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. That's four squared. Four squared. That's it. It equals four squared. Rewrite each number without using an exponent. Okay, so they want you to do the math. So five squared is? No? Five times, oh fuck. I keep on thinking five times two. Times two, I know exponents get a little complicated like that. Okay. So five squared is five times five, which is 25. Perfect. I'm really good at five, 16. Yes, so you can write 16 on number 17. Why? 16, and then 18 you could put... Eight? Four, no. What? What does four squared mean? Four... Four times... Four. There you go. That's it. Okay? I didn't think that's what it was supposed to do. I don't know. Let's check. I have a book around here somewhere with the answer. Um, can you go um, four times four or 16, 16 or four times four. So yeah, that's right. Uh, Easy peasy, huh? Tell me what to you want to do one more? Or no? 
No. Okay, just check your Guys, I hope that you found any of that helpful, entertaining, or informative. If you did, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, give this video a thumbs up. Of course, I will have this linked for you right on down below. You can find me down in the comments or over on Instagram at Making Everyday Magic. Search out, okay? So the Timber Doodle non-religious curriculum kits have been such a wealth of information for myself in looking for things that are non-religious and preferably secular. Uh, and we love Matthew C. I know that in, again, using all the way up through Zeta, I've only ever came across one offhanded reference uh, that Mr. Demi made in a video on averages talking about the valleys will be brought high and the mountains will be brought low, which is a just a, not quoted, just kind of a brief offhanded reference to a Bible passage that if you don't know the Bible passage, you wouldn't know that's what it was. But that in my experience in this entire program up to level Zeta, uh, the one after that's pre-algebra. So all the way up through like elementary level math is the only reference I've ever found. So yes, they are a religious company and they have their values and that's great and rah rah for them, totally love that. Love personal beliefs, but as far as being a secular preferenced homeschooler, I've not had any issues with that in my experience. So I feel like that is worth noting. Again, I will have it all linked down below. Huge shout out to the people over at Timber Doodle and Matthew C for making these wonderful programs available for us because they do work so well in our homeschool. So that's it guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. Mm -hmm.